Watch me turn on the TV. I know what you're here for. Deal. Uh, this isn't how I wanted you to find out. Quit screwing around with my mower. You're pregnant again? This is a simple lie detector. I'll ask you a few yes or no questions and you just answer truthfully. Do you understand? Yes. Do I look like I know what a JPEG is? And we need a nation closer to the Waltons than the Simpsons. <laughs> Stop laughing, you imbecile! Don't you realize how close you just came to killing yourself? Thank you, son. And do you think you could stop the casual swearing? Hell yes. That's my boy. I'm the mascot of an evil corporation. <laughs> Get down from there. Mattingly, get rid of those sideburns. What sideburns? You heard me, hippie. And I overlook these things because... Because? Well, that's the thing. I, I just don't know how to finish that sentence anymore. I have two buttons behind this desk. One will supply your town with power. The other releases the hounds. Just look into your heart and you will find the answer. Oh, oh. oh. Yeah, 3D walnuts. 3D, 3D walnuts. The most expensive it's, walnuts ever. I didn't like, ask for 3D walnuts. We just got them and... And it wrecked the budget for the rest of the season. Is that right? Was it really expensive? Yes! Thank the Lord for this bountiful... <laughs> penis! Bountiful penis! How could you, Krusty? I never lend my name to an inferior product. <gasps> they drove a dump truck full of money up to my house. I'm not made of stone. <laughs> You have to go out there, face that mob, and apologize for what you did. But they'll kill Grandpa! I'm part of the mob! So long, stink town! Oh, hi, is uh, John Swartzwell today? Who? John? Yes. Is this John? This is John. Who's this? John, it's Mike Scully from The Simpsons. Oh, hey, hi. Yeah, so we're giving you a call. You're, uh, you're on the air right now. Do you mind? No, not at all. <laughs> wow! Hey, wow. Yay. John, we just wanted to verify your existence for the fans. Wonderful. <laughs> How much money do I get for that? <laughs> I hardly think the FBI is concerned with matters like that. I've been taking your crap all my life! We have to roll the rock up, up the, back up the hill. We need a real writer's room. So we've got 14 great writers. Now, if a normal level is down on the floor, the levels that we're talking about are beyond my middle finger. Everything was fine with our system until the power grid was shut off by dickless here. Is this true? Yes, it's true. This man has no dick. This is a day for the history book, sir. I'm the first head of the EPA to ever meet a president. It's just been one long and broken cycle of- Somebody throw the damn bomb! Uh, sorry, sorry, no dumping in the lake. Fine. I will put my yard trimmings in a car compactor. Chief, I think there was a dead body in there. I thought that too, until he said yard trimmings. You gotta learn to listen, Lou. I'll let you hold the bomb. The man knows me. Let's ransack a government building! <laughs> Next! Spider pig, spider pig, does whatever a spider pig does. A certain someone had a senior moment, but that's okay because we love him and we got a free rug out of it. Look at my feet. Okay. You like those moccasins? Look in your closet. There's a pair for you. Don't like them? Then neither do I. Get the hell out of here. Ever see a guy say goodbye to a shoe? Yes, once. I will just sign off by saying, this is Joseph Vranick. If you see me in person, please leave me be. Four years of film school for this? You ever tried going mad without power? It's boring. No one listens to you. Shh. I slid my ticket across the table and I said, sorry guys, I gotta see about a girl. <laughs>